back again after completing the chit chat activity of the story his first flight let's continue the real story here his first flight before going to discuss the story flight means a going up above the ordinary soaring we can say in marathi bharari kiwa jhep ghene त्याचे आकाशातील पहिली झेप किंवा आकाशातील पहिली भरारी अशा अर्थाचा हा अशा अर्थाची ही स्टोरी आपण इथं पाहत आहे बिफोर गोईंग टू लर्न्ट द स्टोरी ह्यार इन इंट्रोडक्टरी पार्ट लियाम ओ फ्लॅटरी टेल्स अस दॅट द यंग सिगल हु वॉज अफ्रेड इन हिज माइंड फ्लाईंग इन द स्काय and his parents enthusiasted him but in vain his lastly at the end of the story her hunger his hunger compelled him and he made his first flight now i would like to read the story line by line and try to explain it uh, as well as try to give the meaning of Uh, the hard words please keep the meaning of hard words in your notebook i will read the story here the young seagull was alone on his ledge ledge means a narrow horizontal cell projecting from a wall or here a cliff we can say in marathi samudra kinaryar varcha unch kada yala ledge asa mantla jata and his two brothers and his sister had already flown away the day before he had been afraid to fly with them somehow when he had taken a little run forward to the brink brink means the edge of a steep place kadache sevarche tok it is a edge of a steep or place of the ledge attempted to flap his wings he became afraid and the great expanse of sea expanse expanse means wide area we can say vistar of sea stretched down beneath and it was such a long way down miles down he felt certain that his wings would never support him so he bent his head and ran away back to the little hole under the ledge where he slept at night here the young seagull who was uh sit alone on the ledge he trying to flap his wings but he could not uh flap his wings he appeared in his mind and he cannot fly into the sky he just came on the brinks but because of the great expanse of the sea he appeared in his mind and could not fl- flap his wings to fly into the sky he felt certain that his wings are too short and small so it could not support him to fly in the sky it means that the little young seagull is confident about his uh short and small wings which could not support him to fly in the sky so he is afraid in his mind and he could not do the same activity like his brothers and sisters who already flown away in a very first attempt but he lose his confidence and because of losing his confidence he could not do the new activity here we know that learning a new things it is a matter of a great challenge in our life and one should accept that kind of challenges if we lose our confidence we could not do anything new or any new activity whatever we want to do in our life that is the message we should have to be accept each and every challenge and to dare it muster up the courage within ourselves and do the things properly that is the message even when each of his brother and his little sister whose wings were far shorter than his own 
in comparison with that young sea gull, his brother and sister who flown away yesterday had already flown away. In comparison, he thought that his wings are too short and he could not uh, support him to fly in the sky. But in comparison with that short wing, his little brothers and sister having a very short and small wing. Even they had flown away in a very first attempt. He failed to muster up courage to take that play plunge which appeared to him so, so disparate. Plunge means thirst with a force. We can say udi ghene, disparate, beyond hope, nirash zhalela, to muster up courage, to show courage, dhairya dakhavne. That is the meaning of the hard words. Please keep in your notebook very seriously. Then his father and mother had come around calling to him shrilly, upbraiding him, threatening to let him starve on his ledge unless he flew away, but for the life of him he could not move. Only because the little seagull who is afraid in his mind and life for him, he could not fly into the sky. He, he was confident about his short wings which could not support him to fly into the sky. Had his brothers and sister had already flown into the sky. Even his parents who shrilly and abridging him, scolding him, threatening him, he should have to be made his first attempt. But in vain, he could not do what his parents wants. It means that the little young seagull is very much afraid in his minds. That was 24 hours ago. Since then, nobody had come near him. They, they, all day long, he had watched his parents flying about with his brothers and sisters, perfecting them in the art of flight, teaching them how to scheme the waves, how to dive for fish. He had in fact seen his older brother catch his first herring and devour it, standing on a rock while his parents circled around raising a proud cackle. And all the morning, the whole family had walked about on the big plateau midway down the opposite cliff, taunting him for his cowardice. Cowardice, we know the meaning of cowardice, lack of courage to face the danger. That is a person who is called cowardice. And we know that this young little seagull, all his brothers and sister had already flown away and now his parents perfect him themselves to scheming and how to dive on the fish and catching the fish into the sea. All that, all these brothers and sister enjoying it very well and these young seagull only looking towards themselves. But he could not flap his wings and fly into the sky. And all they gathered all around the young seagull and taunting him a cowardic. They like bhitre panamura, they are bhitre panamura, sarvazan, they are chidvat hote. Ikhre, they are aivadlani, hai ekta sasa hota ki they are pankha madhe bal nirman karun to akasha madhe bharari ghenya sa pretna karatna hota. And this happened. Before 24 hours, he chovista sa pasun gadata lili goshta hoti. He is still on the ledge and nearby that brink. But he could not flap his wings and try to fly into the sky. Even his little brothers and sister who flap his wings in a very first attempt and they enjoying all that things. And they learnt each and every art of flying into the sky which is taught by their parents. Tanja Evalla ne shakav lela pratek kale madhe te parangat hot salle le hote parantu haa lahan pakshi tacha pahelyaats pretna madhe ankin asamartha rahe lela hota ane to tacha pankha madhe bal nirman korun udnya cha pretna to akasha madhe jheb kehna cha to pretna karatna hota. The sun was so now ascending the sky. Ascending the sky means varcha dishene zane. Blazing on his ledge and that faced the south, he felt the heat because he had not eaten since the previous nightfall. Now, 
the little young seagull feel a very hotness because the sun is ascending the sky and it was blazing and from last 24 hours or from the last night he could not eat anything so he feel very hotness uh, and he feel exhausted there because he could not eat anything here we have uh, completed the three paragraph of this story With the remaining paragraph of the story we will learn or discuss in the next video thank you very much